it's me Khadija so in today's video I'm gonna show you guys my high porosity twist out routine for 2022 so the night before I pre pooed my hair with unrefined coconut oil and for my scalp I used the Mish polished hair and scalp oil the following day I went ahead and clarified with the curl mix pure aloe vera shampoo and this is from their vanilla berry collection as for deep conditioner I used the curl mix fresh deep conditioner and this is in strawberry hibiscus so now that my hair has been pre-pooed, cleansed, and deep conditioned, it's ready to be styled. And this is what it's looking like. Super defined. As for my leave-in conditioner, I'm using the Kinky Curly Not Today. You guys know I have been using this since probably about 2016. This has to be my staple leave-in conditioner that always gives me amazing results. Immediately when I apply this, my curls are super defined, moisturized, and shiny. As for my cream, I am using the Carol's Daughter Marguerite's Magic. This is also a staple product that I've been using for years. It has a very thick consistency and it's super moisturizing. As for my sealant, I'm using extra virgin olive oil, which helps to seal my hair, but also adds some moisture as well because olive oil is a softening oil. So I'm just applying that on top and I'm twisting this section of my hair. Also, something new that I've been doing is when I get towards the ends of my hair, I grab some more of the cream and I add that to the bottom. So I'm going to repeat the same exact process all over my hair, applying some water, then my leave-in conditioner, the cream, and then oil. So I do follow the LCO method. This method gives me the best results for my twist outs, super moisturized, and defined hair. So I know you guys are probably tired of seeing these products because, I mean, I've been using them for so long, but with high porosity hair, I feel like it's super hard to find really good styling products and that's why I just use what works. So yeah, hopefully by next year I'll have some new products that I can share with you guys. But for now this routine, it just works extremely well for me and also what you saw me do there was just flat twist my edges. I'm also going to flat twist my nape too once we get finished. but. This routine has worked really well for me over the years and it's just a go-to combination of products that I know I can depend on for a great twist out. So if you haven't tried these products and I've been recommending them for all these years, then I definitely recommend that you pick them up and give them a try for your twist out. All right, so now that one side is done, I'm just going to do the same exact process on the opposite side. So now when I get to the back of my head, sorry about it being kind of blurry, I'm just going to flat twist going across, just like how I did with the front of my hair. And this really helps to keep my nape protected and moisturized. So in total, I have eight regular twists and then three flat twists. Alright 
you guys so this is the following morning as you can see my hair is looking super super juicy i love the shine that i get from this combo of products so i'm just gonna go ahead and take down my twist and if you guys want to see how i pick my day one hair and also shape it then check out my previous video that i did and you can see that process in detail but I'm just gonna go ahead and unravel my twist and these are my day one hair results. My hair is super moisturized, shiny, defined. It just looks amazing, so love this. All right, you guys, so I also wanted to come back and show you all what my hair looks like days down the line because, I mean, day one hair isn't too hard to achieve with high porosity hair if you find good products, but it's about the longevity of the twist out or the hairstyle that you're doing that really proves whether the products are good or not. So this is what my hair is looking like. I have re-moisturized my edges and my nape. This is typically what I do every single night and I'll leave the moisturizer that I use down below. It's the Hydrothermal Naturals Daily Growth Lotion. That's what I use on these areas. And I just took those twists out. I took my pineapple down. I'm shaking my hair out. And at this point, my hair has pretty much gotten into like a shape and have a lot more volume as you can see. So as far as shaping and picking, it's a little less tedious at this point. But I'm going to go ahead with my afro pick, pick my roots going upwards and do that for a bit until I feel like I have a bit of volume. And then I'm going to start to fluff my hair and shape it to my liking. And I'm also picking upside down too, which helps to like get rid of parts and also lift the roots. And these are my day four hair results. So I absolutely love my hair day one day four i typically get a good four to five days of my twist out it really just depends sometimes i'm able to wear it longer sometimes i'm not but i'm definitely going to do a week in my twist out very soon so that is it for this video i hope you all enjoyed if you did please like comment share and subscribe and i'll see you all in the next one bye guys